Hi, I'm Gary from organicweb.com.au and I'm a MailChimp Pro partner. Groups are being used more and more in MailChimp now that the Preferences Center is available. The MailChimp Preferences Center is where people can decide on the options that they want to get. So for example, if you have a group called How Often Do You Want to Get Email Marketing? You could get people to choose once a week, once a month, once a year, and so on. And this is all done through groups. People make their choices, your subscribers make their choices through the Preferences Center in MailChimp. But it's powered, the selections or the options that people choose are powered by what are called groups. Groups in MailChimp, when we're viewing our audience, and this is just a demo audience, we can view our groups by quite simply clicking Manage Contacts, Groups. You can add groups, and each group has, I guess you'd call them subgroups. So, for example, here I'm asking people, what is their favorite color? And I could view groups, and is it blue, orange, pink, and I could add various, you know, various options and so on. When we're importing from Excel, for example, or Google Sheets or a CSV file, there are various ways, or when we're bulk updating people, there are various ways we can update those people. We could quite simply, under Manage Contacts Groups, we could import everyone that uh, is in the blue group, if they're already in our audience, for example. We can also do it through an import, and I'll just demonstrate to you what I think is the easiest way of doing it. Of, of doing the import into groups. So I've already got people in my MailChimp audience. Let me just show you that. So here my people are, but they don't need to necessarily already be there. What I've got here is in a spreadsheet, I've got what group or groups they're in. Pink, orange, pink, blue, orange, etc., etc. I'll show you a very quick and simple way of adding these people to these groups. So let me just copy this data in my spreadsheet. Go back to MailChimp. The easiest way to update in bulk, as far as I'm concerned, is to quite simply do an import. So we go add contacts, import contacts. I will copy and paste and I click continue to upload. I'll just paste in my various data, click continue to organize. Um, I'm, these people happen to be subscribed, so I'm importing as subscribed. This is hugely important. If we click groups and select groups from here, for example, we can't select groups on an individual contact basis. So if we clicked blue here, everyone that you are importing at this time will be uh, will be in the blue group. If you clicked orange as well, they would also be in the orange group. But that's not what we wanted because when we look back at our spreadsheet, some were pink, some were orange, some were all, etc. So I'm not going to click select groups here. I'm going to click update in the existing contacts, click continue to tag. We're not going to worry about tags for now. I will click continue to match. And this is where the magic happens. Because in my spreadsheet, my favorite color or my group field is comma separated, I can just import as a field in MailChimp rather than uh, when we were, were uh, organizing rather than actually selecting groups at that time. So the email address is correct. The favorite color, yes, that is my group field in MailChimp. And you can see pink, orange, pink, blue, orange, etc. I'll click finalize import, check that everything's okay. Click complete import. Let me just view all my contacts. And you'll notice now that in the favorite color field, uh, people are assigned to groups per the import that I did. So um, some people are blue, orange, pink, some are just orange, some are blue, some are blue and orange and so on. So that's how you can very easily bulk 
uh, group people in MailChimp without having to group everyone that's in blue, then everyone that's in whatever color, and everyone. You can do them all in once, and all you need to do is have a comma-separated field for your groups when you do the import from a spreadsheet. Please like this video. My name is Gary from organicweb.com.au.